Amy, and there have been several water main breaks across the metro as temperatures continue to warm up. News Force Taylor Mitchell is looking out for you and to see when some water main breaks in your neighborhood could be fixed as well. This neighborhood near North Portland Avenue and Northwest 9th Street in Oklahoma City has a water main break. You can see this entire street has water flowing down the hill and one resident tells us it's been like this for days, causing water pressure issues in their home. It takes quite a while just to fill up a sink for dishwater. Ashley Reeves says not only is the water pressure low, but overnight the water's been freezing over, causing cars to slide down the hill. Every time it gets cold enough at night, then every morning we wake up and it's a solid sheet of ice. There were, I watched seven or eight cars and trucks this morning trying to scoot up the hill. We have kids that play out here, you know, and the ice and stuff, people sliding around crash into one of our yards, something like that. It's pretty dangerous. And her neighbor, Kevin Ackman, says he's concerned if the issue isn't fixed soon, it's going to make the streets even worse than they are now. It's going to make, you know, sinkholes, you know, especially all the road right there. It's already bad. This is going to make the road worse, you know, and then they're going to have to do a bunch of construction over there, which is going to make it just a hassle. The city's utility department tells us they are aware of the issue and they anticipate working on it this week. As for another water main break in the Gatewood neighborhood near Northwest 17th and Gatewood Avenue, the city's utility department tells us we will work on the leak this week. We are waiting on OG&E to hold a power pole that is in the way. Looking out for you in Oklahoma City, Taylor Mitchell, Oklahoma's News 4. The Utilities Department also tells us since last Thursday, the Oklahoma City Utility Utilities Department has responded to 704 calls and crews have been working through the Christmas holiday to ensure our customers continue to have water and that the leaks are repaired quickly. They also tell us they've brought in a private contractor to provide quick repairs to line leaks.